All eyes are on KMT Chairwoman Hong Shouju as she prepares to meet Chinese President Xi Jinping tomorrow in the latest leg of her China trip. Members of the DPP Legislative Caucus convened a press conference warning Hong not to sign agreements with Beijing that could violate Taiwan's laws regulating cross-strait agreements. This morning, KMT Chairwoman Hong Shouju was in Nanjing at Dr. Sun Yat-sen's mausoleum, where she paid her respects to the founder of the Republic of China. She used the occasion to speak about the peaceful development of cross-strait relations. The night before, Hong met with Jiangsu Provincial Party Committee Secretary Li Chang to discuss the building of amicable relations with China. Although the KMT is the opposition party in Taiwan today, constructing this platform for cooperation will let both sides of the strait continue to enjoy improvements in relations. Tomorrow, Hong will meet with Xi Jinping. Members of the DPP Legislative Caucus were on edge, worried about what Hong might do or say at the summit. We think Hong Xiaozhu may use her visit to China and her meeting with Xi Jinping to pander to and to draw even closer to China in exchange for some favors from China that would let her establish her historical legacy. We are very worried that this meeting between Hong and Xi will challenge national legal precedent because Chairwoman Hong earlier mentioned she might sign a so-called peace agreement. According to Taiwan's act governing relations between the people of the Taiwan area and the mainland area, no agreement with China involving governmental authority or political affairs may be signed without government authorization.